God has sustained me in this season by giving me opportunities to seek Him out uh, and make choices, uh, to be deliberate about searching for Him in this, and He's been my shelter in this storm. Uh, if I was tired, He would bring me through it and show me blessings through other people, sometimes through people that you wouldn't have expected to receive these blessings from and um, has given me a chance to be a light to those people as well. And he's also um, helped me work through some humbling experiences where if I wasn't being the light, um, it was, uh, you know, I'm human and it was okay for me to give that up to him. And he did send Jesus to die on the cross for us. Um, so he's, he's taken care of us already. He's got us in his hands and he knows the plan and all we need to do is seek him for our peace. If I was tired um, and feeling like I didn't have a lot left to give, um, God has given me the strength and the hope uh, for the next day and he has uh, been there when I've asked and even when I didn't know that it was him, he was there. Um, so he got me through every day. Hmm. Um, and there was always that time frame where he always showed up at the last minute um, or was there, but I would realize that he was there. So I've had experiences where I have heard others explain how they were making it through this season and felt that's how I also was feeling. Um, I could see it from different angles and I went through different emotions like a roller coaster. Um, at first I was really scared and um, God brought me back down to a level of peace where I could accept that this is the reality of what's going on around us and has showed me different ways that I can be helpful and that it's okay to ask for help and to be helped. Um, so I've gone through lots of different emotions through this whole COVID-19 world pandemic um, and I found that praying for family has helped to keep me grounded, um, being thankful for something every day, um, even if it's something simple or even if it's just a simple thank you to God. If that was all I could think of to say that day, thank you God. And then he would rush in. So that's been true for me. My neighbors and I have been there for each other more through this. Um, for them to just know that someone can go out and get things for them if they needed it. Uh, and then that was most often returned back where it was like letting the person know that I could help them. They would say, if there's anything you need, I can help you too. Or um, in that way, it was, it, we could bless each other. Um, so it was great to see how so many people in the world had gone above and beyond for other people um, and just they've been the hands and feet of Jesus and um, I've been blessed by people too that don't know Jesus yet and they've sometimes been my blessing in my day because I know that God loves them. You can go to your Bible or if you don't have a Bible you can talk to somebody that reads their Bible and there are so many people in the Bible that have gone through emotions and feelings of the same things that we experience today. Um, so if you have any friends or family that have even a mustard seed of faith, um, and what that looks like for them might not be the same for you, but even just seeking out God's word through the Bible has been helpful to me. And uh, you don't have to be religious in order to receive God's word and have him come into your heart. Um, he can reach us in so many different ways and has blessed me in so many ways.